Yo, what's going on, world? Uh, February 3rd, 2019, um, Black History, highlighting a figure that just not talked about or forgot, um, Julian F. Abel, uh, architect, um, designer at Duke University. Uh, some of his work you can still see today because it's still there. Um, the modern Duke University, but he designed the chapel hall, the the student commons, I think the teachers commons, and a lot of other buildings. This guy was really prestigious um, and, and, and world renowned. They say in his time, during his time, he was one of the most prominent architects in the world. He um, he designed Duke University. 37 years before he was actually able to attend the school, you know what I'm saying? He's, he's a graduate, pretty smart dude, um, pretty aficionado. His work just don't stop at Duke University. He's designed buildings in New York City, you know, um, and he's also designed a lot of stuff in Philadelphia. So you can go look up his work and see what he designed there. But um, this story is really interesting because if the, the CEO of the firm he was working for wouldn't have passed away, he wouldn't he wouldn't have actually been asked to come to the front to sign some documents um, so he can get credit and that's how he got credit. If that death wouldn't have never happened, this guy would just be in the shadows. Um, but he always said um, he, he was the lines on the paper and his CEO, was the, his, his boss was the ink on the paper, just meaning he was taking credit for the work he was doing. So he just got had a really like, you know, a really brilliant perspective and just a brilliant individual overall. Um, during the 1930s, we hear about our history and slaves and being beat and discriminated against. Well, this is this is a whole different narrative and a different level of discrimination. Um, but um, just due to the the nature of it, it's important for our young folks to hear about history when we just not in change or being discriminated against. They need to know we was builders, master architectures, uh, um, supreme mathematics. So yeah, um, Julian. F. Abel was one of those guys that needs to be talking about in history in the history book. So, um, subscribe to the page, talk about Julian F. Abel more, and um, how this conversation with the kiddos and, and your friends is, 